Island Paradise. Exploring the exotic beauty of Seychelles, Seychelles is a mysterious location where nature appears undisturbed by human activities. Off the coast of East Africa, there is a collection of islands in the Indian Ocean that are renowned for their beautiful beaches, coral reefs, and wildlife preserves. You might picture the Seychelles when you imagine paradise. The islands are great for exploring and unwinding because they have so many picturesque locations. Welcome to my travel city. Let's focus on some of the very nice facts and details about the beauty in Seychelles. Enslazio. One of the Seychelles' most stunning beaches lies on the north shore of Proslin Island. You have to climb up a hill to get to the beach, but it is definitely worth the effort. This large area of round granite boulders surrounds a lengthy stretch of smooth blonde sand that blends with gorgeous blue waves. Beachgoers can relax in areas of shade provided by tamamaka trees and coconut palms, and hungry holiday makers can refuel at eateries on both ends of the beach. If you wish to explore the enormous underwater environment at Enslazio, bring your snorkeling equipment. Any time of day is a good time to visit Enslazio. Do you know? Enslazio is one of the most stunning beaches in the entire Seychelles archipelago thanks to its towering and thick Takamaka trees, vibrant turquoise ocean, and smooth rocks. The greatest time to visit for photography is before nightfall, and time to savor a spectacular sunset, even though most people arrive at the beach in the late morning. Ants attendance Mehi. Due to its regular huge shocks and wild waves, this small and isolated crescent of and on the island's south shore is a favorite surfing location. Due to its absence of a protective reef, swimming can be a little unstable when trade winds come from the southeast, but sunbathers, beachcombers, and especially photographers will always appreciate this lovely, palm frame shore. It is a very long beach with fine, smooth sand and stunning waters that are colored vividly green and blue. Only swim when the conditions are safe because the sea can become choppy. This is one of the best surfing sites in Seychelles, despite the fact that you definitely wouldn't want to swim here due to the ferocious waves. If you're just starting out, it might not be the best spot to try boarding, but as you get some practice, you'll love the challenge. Kyrgyz Island, a little island off the coast of Proslin named Kyrgyz, has an amazing main draw. There are 300 enormous turtles free to roam the island. Explore the island's lovely nature, which includes mangroves in the well-known coconut palms, and spot turtles, unusual birds, and other wildlife there. Make sure you give these turtles adequate room because a breeding program here allows them to wander the beautiful sands. Visit one of the Seychelles Islands beaches, which are among the most stunning in the world. Although there are no hotels in Kyrgyz, a day trip is conceivable. Typically, a trip to Kyrgyz takes four to five hours and includes a barbecue. Born Seychelles National Park, nature enthusiasts and hikers will find paradise in the Mern Seychelles National Park. With more than 20% of the island's total area under its protection, this is the Seychelles' largest national park. A mountain range inside its beautiful confines carries the name of its highest point, which rises to a height of roughly 905 meters and offers views of Victoria City. Numerous famous bird species may be found among the animals, and a wide range of indigenous palms, pandanus, pitcher plants, and ferns can be found among the luxuriant greenery. This national park is one of the best location in Seychelles for trekking and wildlife exploration. You'll also get to see some of the island's agricultural side. Bovalin Beach, one of the most well-liked beaches in Seychelles, Bovalin is unquestionably the busiest and most well-known on May, the major island. It's a nice, long beach with high vegetation that offers a lot of free natural shade. White sand beaches in Bovalin are great for lounging, and the area's waters are great for swimming and other water activities. There are many hotels, pubs, and restaurants nearby, and a promenade with food and gift shops surrounds portions of the beach. Both locals and visitors like spending a calm day at the beach or watching the sunset on this bustling beach. 
Locals gather here on the weekends enjoying beach barbecues as hotels and eateries line the beach. Jet skis, water skiing, banana boats, paddle boarding, and other water sports are also accessible. This is an excellent location if your family is traveling. There are lifeguards on duty at all times. And Sorsturgent, Lodi, one of the most popular tourist destinations in the Seychelles is a beach on the island of Lodi. It is recognized as one of the most beautiful beaches in the world due to its massive granite outcrops and quiet, crystal clear waves. Take some gorgeous pictures, unwind on the soft sand beach, go swimming, or go snorkeling while you're there. Children and novice swimmers can explore in safety and comfort. The only way to get to Ansor Sturgeon is through the Lunyan Estate Park, which has an entrance fee. We advise using a bike for quick and effective transportation. Valid Mai. Visit the Valid Mai National Park's calm, shaded coves. This is one of the nicest location in the Seychelles to visit if you love the outdoors. A UNESCO World Heritage Site. This lush park on the island of Proslin protects a prehistoric forest with at least 4.000 instances of the rare big Kodmer fruit palm which is native to Seychelles. Visit the visitor's center to learn more about the park's environment and to witness some of the largest cocoa seeds in the world before beginning your hike. Bring a camera or your phone and really make your loved ones at home envious. To experience this magnificent forest, we advise hiring a guide. Although there are several hiking routes that you might attempt on your own, the guide will educate you on all the indigenous flora and animals of the islands. One of the most intriguing and well-known location in Seychelles is undoubtedly this one. This reserve is easy to tour thanks to the clearly indicated nature trails. There are three alternative itineraries that range in length from one to three hours. Huge rocks cover the forest floor, and towering trees create an overhanging canopy that keeps the roots mostly covered. The valley is home to several rare avian species as well. Bird Island Due to the existence of dugongs in the vicinity, Bird Island was once known as Isles Oxvakes. The island is habitat to a population of migrating sooty terns that grows to 1,500,000 birds during the nesting season, which lasts from May to October. By ascending to lofty observation platforms, bird watchers and photographers can reach the nests. Additionally, the region is home to enormous land tortoises, and big game fishing is popular in the nearby Seychelles Bank. There is only one place to stay on the island, Bur Island Lodge, a basic eco-lodge. This private island hideaway is the definition of paradise because there are no phones, televisions, or Wi-Fi here. Here, the beaches are perfectly clear, and the coral key offers a great diving setting. This is one of the most peaceful, unspoiled settings in the nation, with only one modest hotel and thousands of tropical birds on the island. Victoria, the Seychelles' tiny capital, Port Victoria, was given the name of the British monarch after her coronation and is located on the island of May. All of the key sites can easily be seen in a single day. A well-liked tourist destination is the National Botanical Gardens of the Seychelles, the 15-acre gardens, which were built about a century ago, feature native as well exotic plants, gigantic tortoises, and an orchid garden. The few remaining colonial buildings are grouped around Freedom Square, while new concrete and glass buildings have sprung up all across the city. The most noticeable historical building is the Clock Tower. When it was constructed in 1903, Little Ben, a scaled-down version of Big Ben in London, served as inspiration. Seychelles' first church, after it was destroyed by a rare tropical storm in 1862, was built on the site of St. Paul's Cathedral, which overlooks the square. Visit Seychelles if you're seeking a beautiful island holiday, which is some of the most stunning islands in the world can be found in the Indian Ocean. Despite the fact that couples love the islands, Seychelles offers much more than just resorts and love. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and tell us what you think about this video in the comments box below.